Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and grow as a designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to draw the wow Facebook emoji in Adobe Illustrator. So to start with, I've created a new document, 800 pixels wide and 800 pixels high. We can select the ellipse tool, left click anywhere on the artboard and specify a width of 600 and a height of 600. Click OK. And then if we just remove the stroke, make sure we have the fill selected, double click that, and we're gonna type in the hex color for the yellow. So that's FFD972. And click OK. And then in the swatches palette, you can select a new swatch, tick the global box in case we need to edit that later and click OK and just position this centrally within your artboard and then select the ellipse tool again just left click and drag and we're going to start by creating the mouth so this little fella is quite shocked so position that centrally double click on the swatch in the toolbar and we're going to specify the color for the mouth so it's slightly off black a bit more bluish and that is 262C38. And again, in the swatches palette, just left click on the new swatch icon, select global, and then that's added into our palette, which is great. We can then increase the size of the mouth, holding Alt and Shift and scaling from one of the corners. And just position that towards the bottom. And actually, the eyes are a very similar shape. So with the mouth selected, we can hold Alt and drag to create a copy. Whoa, massive eyes. And then hold Shift. We'll just bring that down to give them some normal sized eyes. Whatever normal is. Okay, so we have one eye. And we can easily hold Alt and Shift to drag that across. And now he or she has two eyes. And we can scale those up together and just position those so you're happy. Now let's hold shift and select both of the eyes and actually we're going to group these together. Now the last thing to create are the eyebrows. So just select the pen tool and left click somewhere on the artboard and then left click again and just drag out that curve. So hold and release. And then we can swap the fill and the stroke and just increase the width of this. We've still got this very, very dark blue, slightly off black color selected. So the same color for the eyes and the mouth and the eyebrows. Now at the moment, our eyebrows have very straight edges. If we select this and then in the stroke palette, make sure we select round as the cap. That's the middle one. You'll see it will round these off nicely. And then we can just position these eyebrows in the respective places. And I'm just going to thicken those up a little bit. And then again, we can hold Alt and Shift to drag across and go up to Object, down to Transform, Reflect, and reflect this shape along the vertical axes. And we can hold shift and select the other eyebrow and as with the eyes go to object group so these are now grouped together so if we were to select these they move around the artboard together let's just increase the size of that mouth a little bit more and then when you're happy with everything the last thing just to check everything is positioned centrally is to left click and drag over all of the shapes and in the alignment options at the top or in the alignment palette on the right, just click horizontal align center. And you'll see that it just positions everything and shuffles everything into place. So we know that everything is central. And there we go. That's how we draw the wow Facebook emoji in Adobe Illustrator. As always, guys, please feel free to leave any questions or comments below. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Take care and I'll see you next time.